Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, thank you so much for subscribing and thank you so much for stopping by. If you're just checking me out today, I am so glad to be back to sit here, to sit here, yes, to be here um, recording this video. I have been feeling really inspired by some makeup looks I've been seeing all over IG and just like friends and stuff that have been posting uh, like their makeup looks. And there's a particular song that has inspired me to do this. It's not like a look from the music video or anything. It's just like what I feel and what I'm being inspired to do. And it's not gonna be anything super crazy, just something really simple, but at the same time still very in tune to the song. <laughs> So a song I have been recently loving is the song with Camila Cabello and Shawn Mendes, Senorita. And I just absolutely love that song. It's just so very like catchy and like makes me want to go salsa dancing. <laughs> I don't know why, but I think Senorita. So let's play a little clip. Okay, that's all we're going to play because we don't want our video to get flagged on YouTube, okay? So the look I'm inspired to do is just a very simple, basic, um, neutral eye. Actually, not even any real like eye makeup, just like a nice wink with a lot of lashes and a bold, bright lip. So if you are interested in seeing this look, then just keep watching. I'm going to list everything that I'm using today in the description box down below. So first of all, we're going to prime our eyes and I love using this Lancome eye base. It's called La Base and it's in the color nude number three. So while that's setting, I'm going to apply a primer. This one here is from Kevin Aquan. It is for oily skin. like set my eye base I'm just gonna take a neutral eye color with a fluffy brush and you can use any color that's like closest to your skin tone today I'm just using this color from the palette from the Naked Basics palette and it's the color Foxy the one right here that I've hit pan on the next I'm just gonna take a very soft neutral brown and I'm gonna use this color here called Soft Brown. This is a shade from MAC and I'm literally gonna just apply this into my crease. Can you guys see how I'm following the natural curve of my crease? That's exactly where I'm letting the brush flow. The next I'm just going to kind of fluff it out on the edges just a little bit. Next, I'm going to take this Olorac liquid liner and we're going to go and create our wing. It's some serious business when we're doing eyeliner, guys, because we can't screw it up. <laughs> so next, we're going to move on to foundation. Today, I'm going to use the Becca Ultimate Coverage uh, foundation. This is in the color Noisette. I do highly recommend this foundation for like any huge events that you're doing, especially for wedding day makeup. This stuff is like the bomb. So next I'm going to use my big fluffy brush to blend all of this out so we can look somewhat normal. Because this is a full coverage of foundation, I am going to go with the damp a little beauty sponge here and just kind of like get over here just to blend it out, especially around the nose and here where I feel like there are brush lines. Because sometimes when you use a brush, it can create lines um, with the foundation. And I usually prefer to use a beauty blender, but I was trying to use the brush today, so that. I'm not a total fan, so just use a beauty sponge. Next, we're going to bronze the skin using this Anastasia Medium Kit. It's a contour kit. I think this is a medium shade. I don't even know, but that's what it looks like.
going to wear these beautiful Lily Lashes. They're the Lily and Sephora collection. Lily Lashes for Sephora collection in Havana. And her lashes are amazing. They are a bit really like out there and really like bold lashes. So I don't typically wear her lashes. I just use like basic Ardell lashes. But I think for this look, it's perfect. basically almost done with this look I am loving the way it has come together I think that it's just very simple but very dramatic as well because we have these very voluminous out there bold lashes I did have to trim it um, I realized when I put the first one on and then when I went to put the second one on this one just seems a lot more fuller I'm like what the heck so I didn't realize that I had trimmed this one previously before I forget before we do the last step, I'm going to apply some um, mascara to my lower lashes. And I'm going to take a little bit of the brown that we used and place it right underneath. Do this before you do mascara, please. But just go right underneath. a little extra highlight so basically I took the same brown that I did in the crease and placed it right underneath and then took a little bit of floof from Mac and popped it right in the inner corner so for the finale of this look we're going to apply this lip color this is from Anastasia it's in the color Ruby and it's just this beautiful red lipstick like look at that I think it's perfect especially for the song it's like senorita let's put on your red lipstick <laughs> So let's go ahead and do that. So here is the completed makeup look. I told you guys this wasn't really anything super hard. Um, I think honestly, if you have a good like 40 minutes max, you could do this look. If you have a quick like 20 minutes you could still pull this look off because it's not a really hard look to create it literally is just one crease shadow your winged liner your pop on some lashes do a little bit of um shadow right underneath do your brows do your foundation little contouring not not anything crazy um a little pop of color of blush and some um concealer and your setting powder your highlight and your bold lips and you are done. I think it came out so well and I did tie my hair back just to kind of make it sleek. Probably should have put some hairspray but I didn't want to put any product in my hair. But I think it looks great. I feel like I should be wearing some kind of like flamenco dress, like something flow with some ruffles, some maybe a flower in my hair, just like a red flower to like a red hibiscus to go with the lips. That's what I'm thinking right now. But I think this is perfect and these lily lashes are really nice. They just make the look very more dramatic and glamorous even though it's not really a super glam makeup look anyways. So I definitely say try it out. This again, I was inspired by the song Senorita from Camila Cabello and Shawn Mendes. It is one of my top favorite songs right now that I'm loving just because it's so like, it's just so catchy and so like, I don't know, it makes me want to go on a tropical vacation or something. <laughs> But anyways, I really hope that you guys enjoy this look. Thank you so much for stopping by and checking out my video today. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you're not already a part of my YouTube family. I would love to have you to be a part of my little family here on YouTube. So guys, thank you so much for watching. And until next time, I'll talk to you later. Bye.